I've actually had a lot of office jobs in my lifetime. And when I'm stuck in a cubicle, I pass the time by inventing things. My challenge for both of you is to build a catapult using the supplies found in this office. In the office catapult, I don't think I could have made it any easier. You're going to launch a rubber band ball 13 feet high, and you have to arc it just right to clear the AC duct and not hit the ceiling above it. I'm giving you three shots to get it right. You have one hour to build your catapult, and your time starts now. I totally thought I was giving them an easy one, but they both blew it. My strategy is to build a catapult made out of rulers and the giant T-frame as the rotating arm. Just need to apply tension down here with the rubber band so that when I pull this, something is gonna snap back. I'm trying to build a frame out of pencils which will hold a firing arm. For the office catapult challenge, if I had had a little more time, I think I would have just redone my whole strategy. This still doesn't spring the way it's supposed to. Unfortunately, this is hindsight. That base is really weak. It's really not working well. What if I adopt a totally different strategy altogether? If I had a larger catapult structure, I think I would have been able to get the job done. Guy, you're gonna go first. All right. I can see one thing going wrong already. <laughs> And I have to stand back while I pull this tension. All right, Randy. All right. This should be much further. Crap. <laughs> you got to get this. We can't let Terry get a double stump. There's a lot of tension in this, so this could be the one that works. Oh, so close. Why don't you get what you built and show me how it's done? Let's see it. Gather around and take a look. Source of tension is going to be the top of the light. It puts more pressure on the arm, which creates more potential energy when I pull back on the arm. In hindsight, it's pretty easy to say that all I needed to do was add some more rubber band power to my catapult to make it strong enough to launch the rubber band ball over the duct. Oh! <laughs> you know what? If, even if I gave him more time or double time or triple time, I still don't think they would have got it. We create challenges designed to outwit each other. Ooh, boy. Take it easy, big guy. My IQ ranks me in the top 2% of the population. I don't like the title of genius, but I'm probably the smartest guy in the room. I'm the smartest guy in the room.